Hello happy people, Hamza here and welcome to this tutorial. Now in this amazing video I'm going to show you exactly how you can create a news blog step by step or you can call it a magazine blog or a blog basically whereby you can publish news every now and then and basically you want to update your viewers on what is happening in real time. And in this tutorial you won't have to have any technical skills on how to build a website. You are in position to build up everything from scratch by basically dragging and dropping and we are going to use a couple of tools that are some are free and some are paid and some of the things that you're actually going to pay for are one you pay for your domain you pay for the hosting these two are basically needed to have your website go online in other words to have your website be accessed by anyone around the web and the other tools that we we'll need are basically the tools that we we'll have to use in building our actual website and these tools one of it is called Elementor and Elementor Pro. So Elementor is a free version that has a couple of tools that you can use. But in this case, since we're not going to buy a theme, so Elementor Pro is the other part of Elementor that will enable us to build up everything from headers to footers and a couple of page sections and templates within our website. Elementor is completely a drag and drop page builder and it's one of the leading page builders out there if not the leading. So I want you to follow this step by step and you enjoy this tutorial when you're creating your first news blog or news magazine website. Now let me take you through on what we'll be creating. So the number one thing when you come over here to our website you realize that we will have a header just like this and I'll take you through every step by step on how to create it having your uh, logo right here the navigation over this side a search bar right up here and your post grid right here for showing probably the latest uh, blog posts that have been published on your website we will also have a post tab right here whereby someone can over over here and see what relevant information or blog posts that are that have been published under that specific category and the other hand we'll also have a sidebar on our website whereby you can link up a couple of sections for example latest blog posts or even social media handles right beside and we'll also have a single post grid right here that will also enable us to showcase a specific uh, blog post or category right down there and i'll also show you how to add this amazingly beautiful uh, post list right down here with a bigger thumbnail bigger title and much more blog content and down here i'll also show you how to create this post carousel down here and how to style it up to completely look like this and on the other hand i'll also show you how you can build up exactly this footer just down here adding your logo uh, description and including your copyright information down here including a navigation down in your footer and on the other hand i'll also show you step by step on how you can create your blog post archive page now this is a page that will be listing all the blog posts that you have on your website and someone can click on any of this and go read further more about that specific story and on the other hand, I'll also show you how to create single blog post templates just like this one, adding a featured image, having a sidebar, a title, and the post content right here. And you can even add your author information, a comment box, and also a post navigation right down here. And I'll also show you how to create single pages right down in this specific tutorial. And I'll take you through how you can add a couple of sections right here and there and have it designed to your preference. And on the other hand, I'll also show you how to add a contact form on your website just like this and also adding maybe a map locator for your business in case people want to visit uh, your offices or your physical locations right down here. Now, the other thing I have to mention is that since this is a news website, people want to know what is breaking, what is happening now and then. Now, in that scenario, I'll show you how to add a news ticker just like this one here whereby people can basically uh, navigate through what is happening there and then and maybe they're updated on what stories are developing and you can even link up these specific sections maybe based on a page, on a blog post or basically on a category uh, section. Now, with that all, I want you to enjoy this tutorial and follow step by step. You don't have to have any fears. And you don't have to have any knowledge or prior knowledge on developing websites. Everything can be done by simply dragging and dropping. So I wish you well building your news blog or your first WordPress website. And don't forget to check out the description box below whereby I'm going to link up a couple of tutorials that I've already created that will enable you also to enhance the functionality of this specific news blog. Enjoy building your first WordPress website.